guys and welcome back to a brand new video. I'm Emily and this is MJ Review and welcome back to Fun Call Friday. This episode is episode number three of the series. We're going to try and keep this going as long as possible. Uh, if you haven't seen episode one and episode two, Go check them out after this video, of course. Number one was Pop in a Box Exclusive World Voldemort, and episode two was uh, Venomized Rocket Raccoon, which is what James did. I did the Voldemort, now it's James. <laughs> Today's video, I will be reviewing the Fleur Delica Funko Pop. I do have both variations of Fleur, and I have the Emerald City Comic Con one, and I have this one. I haven't got the Emerald City Comic Con one on me at the minute because it's packed away as I'm moving house. So yeah, let's get right into it. So this pop is number 88 in the Harry Potter line and there are six pops on the back of the box. There is Sybil Trelawney, Fawkes, Fleur Delica, Victor Crumb, Cedric Diggory and Harry Potter. Out of these six pots on the back, I have three of them, and I obviously hope to get all of them, so yeah. The box on this is very decent, I do like the pot uh, box, and this cost me £10 at, no, it wasn't, it was £7 at Tesco on oh, about a week ago. Yeah, about that. So, let's unbox this pot. Ah, why are you never This, uh, this pop does look like this, and this pop is based off of Fleur's dress in Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, um, when it's the Yule Ball. So yeah, it's a really nice dress. This pop was released in 2019. I feel like the painting on her face is different than other pops. I don't know why. It just feels like a different texture, if you get me. Overall, it's a nice pop. Uh, I like the little, I don't know if you can see it, on my face. Uh, there's, well, there's a pattern around this area of her dress and on her sleeve and it does go slightly onto the top of her back. She has a really nice clip which is holding her bun. I guess it's a bun, it's not really. Her bun in and that is really nice. I think it's used with clear vinyl with and it's a, got painted white things. So I think it's kind of meant to be a Snowflake, I think. This pop also has earrings. Not many pops have ears, I've learnt that now. And I don't know how I didn't realise it before. But yeah, this pop doesn't actually require a stand, as although it is a female, it has got a round bottom. <laughs> That's weird. Well, it's got a wider base basically so it is capable of standing up on its own so there we go that's what that pop looks like from close up i still have yet to order a spinny king so that should be coming soon when i've ordered it probably be a mile a month away so i will expect them then videos will be slower up until i've moved and unpacked and everything uh, well, Funko Friday videos anyway, so James will be taking over that for a couple of weeks while I'm settling into the new house. But yeah, I love this pop. So £37 from Tesco. It's So now I've got both Fleur ones and hopefully I do get all Harry Potter ones. So yeah, nice pop. Has all five fingers. Gotta make sure you've got five fingers. I like the different strokes of her hair, like it looks really neat, oh my, my hair, my hair is crazy, all oh, my baby hairs just don't cooperate, I 
um, you've even got all the creases in her dress. The plaid plaid plaid. I don't know what they're called. We've got them in them, and yeah. So I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I hope to see you all in the next one.